I have spoken. Hey, everyone, this is Digital Charcuterie. Thank you so much for stopping by. Give us a like, subscribe, blah, blah, blah. I really appreciate everything, though, for real. And I love comments in the comments below, so let me know what you guys think down there. Look, the Mandalorian has come and gone, and we got our answers as to who the spies were. They were not the armor. It was not Axe Wolves. It was not Bo-Katan. It was not Grogu. It was not Din Djarin. It wasn't, it wasn't anyone. There were no other spies. It was just the Kane Imperial spy. My first instincts on this one were, was that Kane was the spy, and she represented a plethora of Imperial spies across the galaxy. And I still maintain that. I still maintain that, that Kane... While we saw her, she represented ones every, and the Shadow Council showed us that there were actually Imperials all over, and that you would suspect that they had their own cane everywhere across the galaxy. So that that was my first instinct. However, upon further review and further comments, uh, Dale Erdman and uh, <laughs> some others as well, it's been brought to my attention that the spies may not have been the spies we thought of all along, and this goes. Uh, this is kind of like how. This series has, if you look at titles for some of the episodes, you're like, that's a little cheeky. Uh, there are 12 spies, and this is a biblical reference, and the reference actually directly correlates to uh, the Mandalorians as people and their situation. And the 12 spies, and this is just, I'm just going to read your Wikipedia, so whatever. The 12 spies, as recorded in the Book of Numbers, were a group of Israelite chieftains, one from each of the 12 tribes who were dispatched by Moses to scout out the land of Canaan for 40 days as the future home for the Israelite people during the time when the Israelites were in the wilderness following their exodus from ancient Egypt. The account is found in Numbers 13, 1 and th to 33, and is repeated with, dif with some differences, Psalm 122 to 40. So, I mean, absolutely, that is what it is, right? We had these characters go out to scout the land, of Mandalore to see if it was safe for them to be and and that's what it is so the spies could have been a biblical reference as opposed to a literal a literal spy in the Mandalorian and Axe Wolves and Bo-Katan um, and I you know you see people complain and uh sometimes sometimes you're just not smart let me know what, what do you guys think is this what they refer to as the spies I'm sure we'll find out at Star Wars Celebration Japan 2025 let me know in the comments below thank you for watching everybody and until next time this is the way